So here we are at Nether Craigs on a drizzly Monday morning waiting for the boys to arrive for the 11, sorry, 12 o'clock session. The thing about walking football is when it started off and I started working with Glasgow Life, the challenge was getting people to take it seriously. You mentioned walking football to your friends, to your associates, they laugh, they think it's an anomaly that's maybe for them when they're infirm and too old. The problem now with walking football, now that we're established and we've got hundreds of members here in Glasgow alone and all over Scotland and Europe, is trying to get them not to take it quite so seriously. Because believe me, it can get quite heated. What I wanted to talk about here, specifically, just quickly, was how people misunderstand the rules. They don't take the time to, to study the rules. They don't think about it. So if you come in here, I'll show you something very, very simple that will uh, demonstrate. If you come over this side, you'll see this is the goal line. Now, if I say to you, if that's any line on the park, everybody that knows anything about football or any sport will know that in football, that ball is in the park. It only becomes out the park when all of the ball crosses the line. Out the park, in the park. Okay, simple. If the, if the linesman and referee had known that in 1966, England probably wouldn't have won the World Cup, but that's another video altogether. Let's now look at the goal box. If the same rules apply, which they obviously do, in the goal box, that ball is outside the area. No question. That ball is in the area. Out the area, in the area. When it's sitting here, can the goalkeeper pick it up? If I'm the goalkeeper, of course I can. It's in the area. Can he pick it up when it's there? No. It's outside the area. Now, in walking football, strikers or players who are shooting into this goal cannot go in the area. That's the, 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 the mistake with the rules. What it should actually say is that the ball should be outside the area. So technically, when the ball is in that position, I cannot score. Some people would say I couldn't score anyway without a goalkeeper, but that's beside the point. When it's on the line, it's the goalkeeper's ball, it's in the area. It can't be both in and out. So it's not where the player is, it's not where he's standing. If he's on that line, he's in the box. And if the ball is on that line, it's in the box. Think about it. Thanks, Chris.